Hey guys, what's going on? It's Max here, and today I'm bringing you guys another 100 plus with a vector playing some ground domination on the map raid. Now in this gameplay, I won 133 and three, and I was using the vector with silencer and fast mags, and I was also using lodestar dogs and swarm as my score streaks. Now uh, that's pretty much all I have to say about the gameplay. Hopefully, you guys do enjoy. Went pretty hard at the end, started off kind of slow, but picked it up, and I was able to get a lot of kills. My kill streaks went hard like usual. And uh, yeah, hopefully you guys do enjoy it. So uh, one thing I want to talk to you guys about today is when I think Black Ops 2 will die and people will get bored of it and they won't want to watch it anymore and they won't want to play it anymore, stuff like that, because it always happens to Call of Duty. Eventually, at some point during the uh, the game's lifetime, someone or most people get bored of it and it just depends when that is going to happen. Now, uh, the reason why I think... Call of Duty or Black Ops 2 is going to die out soon. That's my thoughts. Is it's probably going to die out soon, just because of uh, the lack of variety in the game. Like so many Call of Duties have been just like this one. Like this is pretty much similar to Black Ops. Uh, I feel like it's it's exactly like Black Ops. There's no variety. Like Modern Warfare 3 had. Uh, they had support, they had assault, and they had specialist. I ha I had so much fun using specialist in that game, and also the Moabs. That was just really fun. That's what I strongly think that that's why Modern Warfare 3 was uh, popular for a while. And it wasn't very popular, but it didn't get boring. That's well, that's what I'm saying is the game didn't get boring. Of course, there was some horse shit in it. There was some shenanigans like Dead Man's Hand, Death Streaks, support stuff like that. But like it was kind of fun. Like I, I was, I kind of enjoyed it. And like specialists definitely helped out, and so did Moabs. And I know it was kind of frustrating. This game isn't as frustrating as Modern Warfare 3, but it's definitely not as, as fun. That's what I think uh, the Treyarch does. The Treyarch kind of makes more balanced games, where the game is more balanced, more fair. There's not really that much shenanigans in it. But Modern Warfare 3 or the Modern Warfare series and Fairy Ward games, they make those games. Like, they kind of add stuff in. They kind of risk, risk stuff, and they kind of add some different stuff in to try and make some fun for everyone. Like, uh, the Moabs, like nukes. That was really different, and that was really fun trying to get. But also, there's some shenanigans like Dead Man Sand, Death Streak, stuff like that. And um, that's what I think is Black Ops 2 is it going to die soon just because it's just the same thing. Like, we've played this so many times, and plus... Um, like, there's barely any gun kills. You can see, like, I got 133 and 3. I'm not going to even deny the fact that I didn't get a lot of gun kills. And I personally personally didn't think this was very fun to play just because it was all my kill streaks and it wasn't very fun. And that's why I think this game is going to die. Is because the lack of gun killing just makes the game so boring. And everyone's already bored of watching 100 pluses just because it's all kill streak kills that's why Modern Warfare 3 videos were so cool is because there was these Moabs where you have to get them with all your gun kills and you were using specialists it was just really fun to watch because it was all gun kills and it was all just you going around with your gun killing all the enemies by yourself in this game it's just kill streaks and that's what I don't like is the fact that you gotta use kill streaks and I wish there were specialists in this game or some site some sort of like a uh, big ass kill streak the like the Moab or nuke I know there's nuclear metals but like come on what the fuck is that it's a metal why would I want a metal when I can get a Moab like seriously why would I want a metal that does nothing? It pops up for what? Maybe one second? I no, more, Normally, when I actually get it, I miss it during the game. I don't actually notice. And no one no one even notices that you get the Moab. That's what I hate. Ah, sorry. No one even notices that you get the nuclear metal. Because it's only for you. It's not even like it's a kill streak or anything. When you got your Moab, you called it in. Everyone's freaking out. And they're like, oh shit, we just got Moab. Back out. Stuff like that. But nah, you get a nuclear medal, you get a fucking medal, and then no one else notices. And it's honestly not that special. And uh, that's what I really don't like about this game is the lack of gun kills and the lack of variety. And I, I don't know how much longer I'm going to enjoy this and keep playing it. And I, I don't know. It's questionable. But um, let me know your thoughts on this in the comment section below. I'd love to hear your opinion on this game and see. How much longer you think you're going to want to play it for and stuff like that. I just got the Prestige Master and honestly I don't have that much motivation to play this game anymore. Just because it's kind of boring. I'm going to do a combat record and all my stats tomorrow. But uh, that's pretty much it guys. Hopefully you guys did enjoy the gameplay. Once again final score is 133 with a vector. 
And uh, if you did enjoy, I'd really appreciate it if you left a like. And also subscribe if you're new. And I'm signing out. Peace.